can i tell you this there is nowhere in scripture where satan ever took god unawares the intelligence the all-seeing eye the light he shrouds himself with light as a mystery he does not wait for time to reveal events he is called alpha omega there is no end in between and so according to his predeterminate counsel he's already created a formation to manage this pride of babylon there is an emergence of men and women not just men in pulpit ministry please hear me this must become our advocacy to train only men of god is a dangerous campaign we more that they all come and pray and fast together but once we are done training them in church we must diverge them to the geography of their assignments where a businessman is fasting the same way a pastor is fasting and you are saying why go through that burden i thought it's just an intellectual adventure you said don't be carried away by my suit and tie there is an apostle behind that suit and tie sends to the marketplace you know one of the mistakes that we make and men of god we must take we must take responsibility for that mistake is that in a bid to keep the sense of spirituality we have downplayed every other mountain that is not the mountain of religion so we tell people don't worry all you have to do is focus be a man of god so when people begin to find unusual desire for the things of god and they find out that why is education pulling me like this they become guilty for wanting an area that is not ministry they don't know what to do with their passion and their hunger whereas there is a, the lord of the harvest the holy ghost in people to the geography of their impact let me tell you this i said it the last time i was here if god is calling you to be a prophet or an apostle the character and the nature of your training will never be the same as someone who is going to become a politician are we together after you pray five six hours you may be tired but the guy who is called into the prophetic and receive a vision to continue and turn that prayer into three days you do not use the template of your training to bully or demean another it is a it is a training that is a mark you will find out that that educationist can sit down for three days and not come out and all he's doing is studying we must sustain this discernment because whilst we have our members not all of them will become men of god like we call it not all of them will become lecturers not all of them will become business people we must sustain the intelligence to discern the geography of their assignment and to help them like eli helped samuel it is one of the greatest balance we can bring to what is going on right now in the body of christ there are many people on the pulpit today who have no business with the pulpit the nature of their call they are so ineffective and they are wondering it's not backsliding the more they know god the more they fail in pulpit ministry because their knowledge of god is pushing them closer to their assignment